Disney didn't think things through. At least half of their consumer base is families with children, and they lean heavily conservative. Wokeness is definitely a losing proposition for a company like The Mouse. Woke means you pretend to care about certain causes, but the end goal is always money, power or control over what people think. Disney is just doing what they think will bring money. It's not that deep. And those old stories like Snow White have been told and changed already over the years. Variations of Red Riding Hood, for example, have been found going back way longer than its 17th century telling. And Disney has always changed the stories themselves a lot. The different races for The Little Mermaid was just meant to represent the seven seas. It's really not a big deal. Kids don't know the difference and these are ultimately fairy tales. People throw the word woke out so much it means nothing. Younger gens like to see more diversity and younger gens are Disney's demographic. If you have to qualify a statement like I'm all for diversity with a but, then you are not actually all for diversity. Ariel and her sisters are different races because as the daughters of Triton, king of the ocean, the seven of them together are meant to represent the seven seas. She can also sing, like characters tend to do in Disney movies. If you're going to complain about something, actually have an iota of knowledge about what you're supposed to be complaining about. Woke is a meaningless, nebulous term. It means nothing and just makes you look foolish to use it. What is woke? Disney does what it thinks will make it money. They don't care about identity politics or wokeness. It cares about making money. And four of 2023's 10 highest grossing movies so far are Disney movies. Four of 2022's 10 highest grossing movies were Disney movies. So whatever they're doing, it's clearly the right thing for them. Calling racial, gender, and LGBTQ inclusivity and just about anything you don't like woke is cringe and childish and it makes you look stupid. Especially when you don't even know what woke means, how come people complain about Disney being woke? But no one batted an eye when Disney movies were sexist and borderline racist. Disney has been around for over 100 years now. 70 years of that had moments of racial stereotypes throughout their movies and some sexist undertones. But those were the good old days. Now Disney promotes diversity and inclusion the last half decade and now everyone has a problem with it. Honestly. It's all about money. Disney doesn't do it because they want to be inclusive. If they did, they would not have alluded to one of the main characters in Strange World being gay a total of four times throughout the entire 1.5 hour runtime of the movie. In scenes that are easily edited out without losing anything, after marketing the movie as being their first to have a gay main character. And after all, why would they? If they went any further, they couldn't sell the movie in China or the Middle East as easily as cutting out or editing a handful of scenes, because they chose their target audience, and that target audience is woke. It's simply following market research and whatnot. They probably came to the conclusion that this is the fastest growing audience and they want to get on board as soon as possible. Invest wisely. And as always, take care of your money.